Looks like Hunter Biden. We believe that's Hunter Biden. Yep. Uh, we see it is Hunter Biden arriving now to the courtroom, to the courthouse. Clearly, that's one of the requirements, right, uh, Jeff? I mean, and now we have uh, some of the uh, results. Uh, if we could, Ken. I'm told we're count not. We one, can't report it yet. The jury so we're finds verifying. him guilty. Count two. The jury finds Hunter Biden okay. guilty. And on count three, which is possession of a firearm by a drug user or drug addict, guilty. At this point, we wait to hear more uh, whether there might be some reaction from the president himself, himself in the form of uh, a statement. And uh, just noting to Jose that the president has said uh, that he loves his son, that he and the first lady love their son, that they're proud of him and the person that he's become, uh, referencing his ability to, to uh, combat a drug addiction uh, and to seemingly come out on the other side a, a better person. And so uh, at this point, Jose, we'll wait to see if we hear more from, from the president. Hunter Biden has been found guilty on all counts in his gun trial, federal trial in Wilmington, Delaware. All right, Leo, your first response. My first response is I go back to the Harris Faulkner Leo Terrell segment about <laughs> six months ago. When you asked me that question, uh, is there any way that plea deal could be stopped? I said the judge. The judge play the major role in the rule of law by saying I'm not going to agree to this plea deal, had questions, and that's why we're here today. The American public needs to know that. That is the rule of law, and I applaud the judge that she did an outstanding job in following the rule of law. Form ...when he purchased a Colt 38 special revolver back in 2018. Uh, the second charge is lying on the federal registry, which accompanies that form, and the third charge was illegally possessing a firearm. Uh, all uh, having to do with his possession of that gun and his purchase of that gun when he was abusing or addicted to drugs. That was the question in this case. Did the jury believe that at the time he bought that gun, he was abusing...